As always, let's skip the bullet points, go right to the question. The student wants to present the study and its findings. So right away, I'm a little annoyed because I don't know, is this one goal or is this two? Present the study and its findings. Eh, the findings part is understandable to me. To present a study could mean anything, but findings of a study, that's important. So I'm going to focus on that first. So A, a study led by Aralee, whatever, identified a total of 74 species in the temperate forests of Oaxaca, Mexico. Okay, well, I guess that's findings. They identified 74 species. Maybe? I, 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 I genuinely don't know. Let's look at B. There are orchids in many environments, but there are 74 orchid species in Oaxaca, Mexico. So, okay, but that's not talking about a study. That is not talking about that. those 74 as being the findings of a study. It just says it is a fact. So, no, I, can, I think this is wrong. Oaxaca, Mexico is home to temperate forests containing 75 of these species. Again, it's not saying about the study. It just says it as a fact as if we already know that it's true. This person and her team wanted to know how many different species are present in the forests of Oaxaca, Mexico. So they conducted a study to collect orchids. Now that is definitely presenting the study. But does it talk about the findings? No. They said they wanted to know these things, but they didn't actually get uh, – we don't know the number. They don't. We don't know anything. So it's got to be A. And, and this is the thing. This goal number one, and as much as it's even a goal here, is very vague. Present the study just kind of means maybe like mention that there's a study. The findings piece though, that is very understandable to me. That means the conclusions, the results. They found 74 species. It didn't – feel so much like a, a finding at first, but after looking at the other choices, it's pretty clear. I would not need to go to the bullet points here. Uh, I'd be very confident in A, but notice how right from the get-go, I was kind of already thinking, is this one goal or two? And I erred on the side of it being two goals, thinking about those two things separately. And uh, I think it gave me more confidence in my answer when I found it.